Celtics hosted the Knicks, and the Celtics are seven and a half point favorites. The over/under is at 222 and a half. The Knicks are plus 235 on the money line, and the Celtics are minus 300. Now these are pre-confirmed lineup and pre-tip-off lines. Now if they take some players out, chances are these lines are going to shift. Now thank you for everyone who has joined the Discord and who continues to join the Discord. If you've not done so yet. Go to my website, rawsportstalk.com. It is a paid membership, but it will give you access to my best bets. Win, lose, or draw, you'll see how I've been doing. And we've had some big winners in there, so I really do appreciate you guys. Now, this is practice preseason, and this is just to give you guys some information before the 20 minutes before game time that they like to announce who's actually starting in these games. So, uh, R.C. Kono, uh, R.C. Diacondo is a game time decision for the Knicks. Jalen Brown and uh, Jason Tatum are also game time decisions for the Celtics. Now, that means nothing if they decide to go out and play all their starters like what happened with the Suns last night. The Suns didn't play all of their starters, but they played most of them. Now, head to head, the Knicks are six and four. The Knicks are on a three game winning streak. The underdog is on a three game winning streak. The underdog is six and four against the spread. The favorite is five and five on the money line. The over is six and four in their last ten. The under two twenty two and a half is six and four, and the home team is seven and three. Now that's based off of the regular season. In the preseason, these teams did play each other, and the Knicks won that game, uh, one hundred fourteen to one hundred seven, a total of two hundred twenty one points. The Knicks are one and one. There was two hundred thirty three points and two hundred twenty one points in their two preseason games. The Celtics are two and one, two thirteen, two twenty one, and two twenty. I'm going to take the Knicks with the money line. I'm going to take the Knicks getting the points, and I'm going to go under. I'm skeptical because both Brown and Tatum are listed as game time decisions. If they both play, I would consider taking the Celtics, but I still think 7.5 is a tad bit too much for division rivals. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.